Article 4, moving right along. See if the town will vote to determine the date taxes shall be due as September 30, 2016, and the rate of interest to be charged on unpaid taxes is 6% per year, and the date such interest commences is October 1, 2016. Recommended by the Board of Selectmen. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 5, to see if the town will vote to authorize the selectmen to sell and dispose of any town-owned tax-acquired property on such terms as they deem advisable and execute release deeds in the name of the town for such property. Recommended by the Board of Selectmen. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Any opposed? It's a vote. <clears throat> Article 6, to see if the town will vote to authorize the municipal officers to spend an amount not to exceed one quarter of the 2015 annual budget during the period from January 1, 2016 to the March 2016 town meeting. Recommended by the Board of Selectmen. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? I'll call for a vote then. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? I'm sure you're breathing a sigh of relief on that. Article 7 to see if the town will uh, uh, vote to raise and appropriate $139,036 for officers' salaries. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 8 recommended uh, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $63,450 for town operating expenses recommended by the Budget Committee. Second. They've moved and seconded. Any discussion? Not hearing any. <clears throat> I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 9. To see uh, if the town will vote to raise an appropriate $2,300 for assessing recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. Call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? Article 10, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $75,464 for code enforcement, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Any none? Uh, all in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. <coughs> Article 11, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $9,400 for planning board. Expenses. So moved. Second. Then moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. Call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 12, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $20,000 to continue to develop a watershed management plan for the mountain development area. And there's an explanatory note uh, which uh, and talks about what's been spent to date and uh, that the, this funding request will complete phase two and that uh, it be uh, completed next year for approximately $10,000. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? <coughs> Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Article 13, see if the town vote to raise an appropriate $9,950 for Selectman's Contingency Fund to meet unanticipated expenses, contribution requests, and emergencies that arise during fiscal year 2016. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? 
Hearing none, I call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? <coughs> That's a vote. Article 14, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $127,200 for police protection, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 15, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $113,500 for the Communication Center operations, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Not hearing any. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 16, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $87,952 for fire department operating expenses, recommended by the Budget Committee. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 17, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $35,096 for a fire department equipment reserve account. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved and seconded. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor? Any opposed? Article 18, to see if the town will vote to raise an appropriate $50,000 for a new mountain location fire station reserve fund. Uh, Sugar Oak Mountain Corporation at some point needs to take back the space where the fire truck is up on the mountain. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Opposed? That's a vote. Article 19, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $85,529 for ambulance service subsidy, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any, <coughs> any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 20, to see if the town will vote to raise an appropriate $7,535 for animal control, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Moved and seconded. Discussion? Not hearing any. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Article 21, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $35,200 for town insurance policy coverages, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved and seconded. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 22, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $57,176 for Recreation Department Expenses and Programs, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 23, see if the town will vote to raise an appropriate $214,117 for expenditures for the anti-gravity complex. And there's an explanatory note that there is offsetting revenue that comes in against some of that. Uh, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved and seconded. Moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 24, to see if the town will vote to raise an appropriate $18,000 for recreation facilities as follows. Playground repairs and equipment replacement, $1,000. Town park capital improvements, $2,000. Narrow gauge pathway maintenance, $14,000. Outdoor center operations, $1,000 for a total of $18,000. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Is there any discussion? Hearing none, I call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 25, to see if the town will vote to raise an appropriate $21,000 for the JV Wing Snowmobile Club, 
for snowmobile trail grooming and maintenance and to see if the town will vote to appropriate the money received from the state for registration of snowmobiles. Estimated to be $300 uh, to the J.D. Wing Snowmobile Club. That's recommended by the Budget Committee. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 26, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $25,000 for mountain bike trail development at the Outdoor Center, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? Article 27, to see if the town will vote to authorize the Board of Selectmen to implement the recommendations of the town's forest management plan for the town's public law and to expend revenues received from the proceeds of the implementation for costs associated with developing forest management plans, forest management activities, and maintenance and improvements to the outdoor center roads and trails. The explanatory note says uh, that they want to reserve these funds for uh, tra uh, the trail bridge replacements. Recommended by the Board of Selectmen and the Budget Committee. Moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 28, see if the town will vote to expend the following amounts from the recreational, uh, recreational endowment fund for the following purposes. McDonald Junior Golf Program, $1,504. Town matching funds for the Mountain Bike Club grants and donations, 15,000. Town matching funds for Main Hudson Trail grants and donations for two, two projects, 32,000. Town matching funds for the Caravasa Valley ATV Club for trail projects, 3,000. Town matching funds to assist the nonprofit Longfellow Mountains Heritage Trails, Inc. Uh, to develop a multi-use people-powered trail that, if successful, would extend from Kingfield to Colbin Gore, 2,500. Town matching funds to assist the Carabasset Outdoor Association and Stock Association in stocking the outdoor center pond with fish, $300. Town matching funds to assist the Carabasset Valley Outdoor Association in expanding a trap shooting facility which is open to the public, $15,000. That's a total of $69,804. And the explanatory note uh, explains that uh, uh, these funds that require uh, at least a one-to-one -one financial match. And there was $309,462 in the fund at year end. Budget committee recommends approval. So second. Moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I call for a vote. All in favor? Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 29, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $50,000 to be placed into the Recreational Endowment Reserve Fund, and in addition to place revenues from the cell tower lease, estimated $12,000 into this reserve fund. Budget Committee recommends approval. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 30, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $58,493 for operation of the Carabasset Five Valley Public Library. Budget Committee recommends approval. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Yes, I have two questions. Go ahead. Um, first of all, I think it would be really nice if we had library, library hours that went to at least 6 o'clock. In most small town libraries, there, there's one night that the library is open until 9. Um, we have a much, bunch of people in our community who commute back and forth to work. They work 95. The only opportunity they have to use the library would be on weekends, and they probably would like to be skiing rather than taking a book out of the library at that point or, or, or being with their friends, you know, family, whatever. My second one is in re reference to um, this book. On page four, 
the board members for the library appear to be from just the year that, uh, 2015. There are no um, expiration dates on term. There are no terms listed here. Is this a type of That would be my question. Anybody know? Any comments? Because most boards have term limits. In fact, all the boards I was ever on, and there were many, had term limits. Uh, my name is John Wolfram. I'm one of the selectmen and the newest member of the library board. Can you hear him um, all right? Can you hear me? Uh, yeah. Okay. Um, in and amongst this number is uh, a proposal to make Andy become a full-time member of the Carabasso Valley uh, payroll. In, in and amongst that budget increase is to increase hours. Now, I can't tell you tonight what those specific hours are going to tell you there later, but I know there's an increase of hours built into the budget numbers. Um, we understand your grievance, and uh, we do want to expand the hours. Make well, them. John, I wouldn't say it's a grievance. It's a concern. Okay, a concern. Okay. Sorry, grievance wrong. Grievance is an entirely different thing. My concern is that there are people who live in this community and, and go to work from 9 to 5 during the week, and then they proceed to um, have to come to the library on the two days that they have off with their families. And also, the fact that all libraries that I have ever known had at least one night a week that they were open till nine. And I lived in a town that had a library that was open three days a week, and one of those days it was until 9 p.m. So. You have a very valid point. Cora would have loved to have had it open longer, the librarian, but that was all the town would vote in. We have someone else who wants to speak to the issue. Uh, Jean? Um, I believe we had the library open for two years during the evening hours up until 7 o'clock, and we had so few that, that we went, we went back to having it open Saturdays and Sundays, and then closed at 5. But the board of directors would be glad to discuss it. Um, we may be able to find someone who would be willing to work evenings. Jean, does your board also See if the town will vote to raise and appropriate thirty thousand two hundred dollars for operation of the community center building. The budget committee recommends approval. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Discussion. Not hearing any. Uh, call for vote. All in favor. Aye. Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article thirty-two. See if the town will vote to allow the child daycare service provided by. The nonprofit corporation Western Maine, Western Maine Center for Children to occupy their current space at the <coughs> library community center building at no cost for 2016. There's an explanatory note saying that for in the beginning we played a thousand dollars a month and a third of the utility cost, uh, but they haven't been able to uh, afford it since. Uh, it's recommended by the board of selectmen. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? <laughs> Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? That carries. Article 33, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $21,660 to operate the airport. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Seeing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Any opposed? That's a vote. 
Uh, Article 34 to see if the town will transfer airport revenues collected in excess of the airport revenue budget, $1,200, into the airport reserve trust fund recommended by the budget committee. So moved. Second. Then moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 35, to see if the town vote to raise and appropriate $75,000 for maintenance and plowing of town roads, parking lots, street lights, and for street and house number signage. Uh, not included in there is ten thousand dollars for annual maintenance. Or included in there is ten thousand dollars for annual maintenance for the carriage road, uh, in accordance with the terms of the agreement the town has with the Penobscot Indian Nation. Uh, that's recommended by the budget committee. So moved, second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That the motion carries. Article. Uh, 36 to see if the town will vote to place state of Maine MDOT highway funds estimated to be $3,700 in the town's highway reserve fund for future highway projects recommended by the budget committee. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. All, all in favor? Aye. Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 37, uh, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $16,000 for the maintenance, repairs, and improvements to town buildings and grounds recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 38, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $142,000 for transportation services, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? I see none. Uh, call for a vote. Any, all in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Uh, that's a vote. Article 39, see if the town vote to raise and appropriate $215,600 for solid waste disposal and recycling. Recommended by the Budget Committee. Moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 40, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $316,217 for obligated debt and to see if the town will vote to accept and expend an additional $151,914 in payments from the Sugarloaf Mountain Corporation as their contractual share of the debt, of the debt service. Uh, and to accept and expand a private donation of $17,000 for the Library Community Center debt, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, uh, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's the vote. Article 41, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $192,500 for employee benefits and requirements. So moved. Seconded. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 42, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $6,000 for the Flagstaff Area Business Association. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So been moved and seconded. Any discussion? I'll, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 43 to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $6,000 for maintenance of the information center. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 44 to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $10,000 for ski club scholarship grants, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. 
Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Do Article 45 see if the town will uh, vote to raise and appropriate $12,000 uh, for the town scholarship fund recommended by the Budget Committee? So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. Call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 46, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate up to $1,200 for seasonal lighting, recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? It's a vote. Article 47, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $3,000 for maintenance and improvements to the cemetery. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? <coughs> That's a vote. Article 48, see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $5,000 to be managed by Sugarloaf Mountain Corporation for the Golf Course Reserve Fund and to authorize the Board of Selectmen to expend those funds for golf course capital repairs and improvements. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Discussion? Hearing none, call for vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? <coughs> That's a vote. Uh, Article 48. I guess I did that one. Article 49, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $10,000 for the town's capital maintenance responsibilities associated with the golf course clubhouse. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 50. To see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $1,000 for general assistance aid. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none. Call for vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 51, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $2,000 to assist the Sugarloaf Area Christian Ministry of Caravasa Valley Network Seniors Committee in providing an elderly services coordinator to encourage an aging community to pursue long-term residency and independence in our area, providing daily telephone contacts and a web based network of resources and services available. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Second. moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing on a call for vote, all in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote, thank you. Uh, Article 52, to see if the town will vote for, to appropriate funds from overlay for abatement, abatements and overdrafts. Recommended by the Board of Selectmen. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, call for vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? And that's a vote. Article 53 to see if the town will vote to carry the following account balances forward. Estimated balances as of December 31st, 2015. And he's moved this way. If there's no objection to that, is there any discussion? Uh, hearing none, uh, call for a vote. Any all in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 54 to see if the town will vote to expand funds in excess of $1,500 from the mountain bike race that is generated to provide Funding to the Caravasset Valley Mountain Bike Club for trail development and maintenance. Uh, there's a note this funding is revenue from the annual mountain bike race that's sponsored by the town but managed by the club. Recommended by the Budget Committee. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Is there discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? And that's the vote. 
Article 55 to see if the town will accept the categories of funds listed below. Uh, Move the slate to 37,950. I was hoping somebody would do that. <laughs> We're here for If there's no objection, we'll accept moving the slate. Any discussion? Call, uh, the being none, I'll call for vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's the vote. Article 56, to see if the town will vote to extend the following revenues from the following counts to reduce the property tax commitment. I move this late of $535,610. Yeah. Is there a discussion? It being none, uh, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 57, to see if the town will vote to authorize the Board of Selectmen to contract with Snowfields Productions, the operator of WSKI TV Channel 17, to expend up to 25% of town revenues received from cable TV franchise fees to provide a town of Carabasset Valley marketing and promotional program on terms and conditions the Board deems to be in the best interest of the town, recommended by the Budget Committee. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 58, to see if the town will vote to authorize the Board of Selectmen to renew a five-year lease with Sugar Mountain Corporation for operation of the outdoor center facility and Nordic ski trails on such terms and conditions as the Board deems to be in the best interest of the town. Board of Selectmen recommend approval. Been moved and seconded. Discussion? Hearing on the call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 59 to see if the town will vote to transfer the 2015 unexpended amount of $11,338 from the Outdoor Center Bond Debt Service Account to the Outdoor Center Capital Reserve Fund and to expend this fund in 2016 revenues collected from the lease of the outdoor center for capital maintenance and improvements to the outdoor center facility and to transfer the year-end balance of 2016 lease revenue to the outdoor center capital reserve fund. Uh, there's an explanatory note with the addition of the, that amount. There's $53,245 in the cap, that capital reserve fund and the lease provision provides for the town to receive up to $10,000 per year in lease revenue. Board of Selectmen recommend approval. So moved. Second. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, a call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 60. To see if the town will vote to authorize the Board of Selectmen on behalf of the town to apply for, accept, and expend federal, state, and other sources of revenues for town purposes during the fiscal year 2015. This does not include any monetary local match the town may need for these grants. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Is It's been uh, an, an amendment to the motion has been offered uh, to fix the typo. It should be 2016. Is there any discussion about that? It being done, a uh, call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Now you get to vote on the article itself. Uh, as as read, accepted. Now it says 2016. Is there a motion on that? It's, it's been moved and seconded. Uh, is there discussion? There being none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. And opposed? That's a vote. Shall the town, Article 61, shall the town of Carabasset Valley vote to approve the Community Development Block Grant Project Development Application? 
for the following program and dollar amounts. Uh, the program is Micro Enterprise Assistance Program in the amount of $150,000. And to submit the same to the Department of Economic and Community Development if said program is approved, to authorize the municipal officers to accept said grant funds, and to make such assurances, assume such responsibilities, and exercise such authority as is necessary and reasonable to implement such programs. Furthermore, the Town of Carabasset Valley is cognizant of the requirement that should the intended national objective of the CDBG grant not be met by all CDBG funds, uh, all CDBG funds must be repaid to the state of Maine CDBG program. Uh, it's been moved and seconded. Yeah, I gotta, should I read it again? No. <laughs> Is there any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Article 62, to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate $100,000 as a contribution to the proposed new Carabasset Valley Academy Competition Center at Sugarloaf. And there's an explanatory note as to, it's estimated to cost $2.1 million, and the project funding so far coming from uh, the listed sources. And that construction must be completed by November 15, 2016. The Board of Selectmen and the Budget Committee recommend approval. So moved. Been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, I'll call for a vote. All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? That's a vote. Thank you. Is there any further business to come before this meeting? I heard a motion to adjourn and a second. <laughs> All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? You can stay. So is it right? Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. It's 72 minutes, it's 72 minutes.